252-442-4200. We'd be glad to help you out. I'd like to say, too, thank you to the barbershop out there in Oakwood Barbershop, uh, Furfew Lane. Yes. Furfew Lane, uh, Keith, Troy, and Wayne. They do a great job out there. Uh, we got Steve Harvey today. Um, the guys are really good. So check them out. Oakwood Barbershop, off if you're Furfew Lane, in Rocky Mountain, North Carolina. Hey, it's tight and it's right. <laughs> Amen. Thank y'all. This new data on the antioxidant content of thousands of foods revolutionize the way my family eats. For example, you've known me as a veritable green tea fanatic, not because I particularly like it, but because that's what the science said was the best thing to drink. But that was before 283 beverages were tested. I don't think I could even name 283 beverages. They tested everything from Red Bull to Crowberry liquor. Let me pull out a few. Water has zero antioxidants, as does Red Bull. At this scale, Pepsi, Coke, and cow's milk get a 1. A glass of white wine, cup of red tea, black tea, green tea, red wine, seven times the antioxidant power of white, but neither as good as grape juice. Here's a shot of espresso, cup of coffee, and matcha tea. Tea made out of powdered green tea leaves, which is what I've been drinking. But what is this? I mean, what beverage could possibly be better than actually eating green tea leaves? Matcha has met its match. In terms of antioxidant power, the healthiest thing to drink on the planet Earth may be hibiscus tea. So like you know, red zinger blows everything else out of the water. So here's my latest recipe. Half a gallon of water, eight cups, four bags of any tea in which hibiscus is the first ingredient. I like wild berry zinger. The juice of one lemon, and three tablespoons of erythritol, or um, you could uh, blend in some dates. Uh, I just put it in the fridge overnight. No need to heat it. It can just cold brew. In the morning, I take out the tea bags, shake it up, and drink it throughout the day. Every day, all day long. And as always, extra credit for green foam. Pour a cup of the tea into a blender with a bunch of fresh mint leaves. Blend on high, and then pour it back. So you have dark green leafies blended into what may be the highest antioxidant beverage in the world, and it tastes like fruit punch. Your kids will love it. Yes, we have a special on the hibiscus. You can get a gallon of hibiscus for $20, and we take 50% off your next order of any of our herbal drinks. We have raspberry. It's good. It has a lot of high fiber in it, which makes you feel full throughout the day. We have coconut which is good for your immune system. It gives you uh, hair, your hair growth, um, strengthening your nails. It also boosts your immune system. And it also helps you kind of lose weight too because it keeps you full throughout the day. Pineapple and ginger is rich in iron, vitamin C. Gives you a lot of energy. We have the lemon ginger, which is good for appetite suppression, high in vitamin C. Helps fight this cold and flu going around. Very good for that. And we have the hibiscus, which is good for high blood pressure, Boosts your immune system, lowers your cholesterol, heals cuts and wounds, fights off infections, and you get your mental clarity. That's some of our drinks that we have. And like I said, take advantage of our special we have going this month. Buy any hibiscus, which is $20 for a gallon, and you get 50% off your next gallon. Thank you, and put God back in the healing business. Get the juice. Get the juice. Get the juice. Get the juice. People, please. Amen. Young man, I don't know where you come from. You know, but God bless you. If you, you can't be a, a man pleaser and be God's messenger. Amen. Amen. You can't do it. You can't shake the face of the folk and figure out what you're going to say. Say, now I'm going to make that man that man. I'm going to make that brother that man. So say that. You see, you got to say what God told you to say. And God got to know what you're going to do so. Regardless, and Dr. Newell uh, told the president, be not afraid of their faces. Amen, that's right. You watch folks' faces, it will tear you up sometimes. It will right. encourage you, intimidate you. You Come see? On, yeah. You got to be God's message. You know what Paul told him? He said, look, when God, who from a mother's womb, he called me. 
He, he said, I didn't get this thing from man. Man didn't keep it, man don't tell me what to say. Amen. Come on, yeah. You gotta be God's messenger. So the whole thing is, in the final analysis, what God says is what's gonna count. And with the final analysis, you line up with God's word, and you're gonna be found waiting the balances and found lacking. Amen. So again, the day you hear his voice, harden out your heart. Let me tell you what, folks, that the prophetic signs are already here. What else does it take? Look at what I can do. When I was a young boy, I could be in the field, look out across the, in the west, and see the clouds a certain way. Look at the sun a certain way. Take on rain tomorrow. I can smell the wind when I was a young boy. Watch the old pop of leaves upside down. A low pressure. It's going to be during the rain. I watch the old mule the way they act. <coughs> watch the frogs and the ants. I can tell you it's a rain coming. Amen. Folks now don't see signs no more. Mm -hmm. I can look around me and folks can see the wrath of God on our nation. Amen. Right. On some of our homes. On some of us as individuals. When we take heed to it and call on the one who can help. And that's too big for God to do, folks. Amen. So I want to warn you, I want to encourage you. The day you're here for it, harden out your heart. You have to see Jesus Christ as your Lord and your Savior. Do so today. You know what, folks? This place right here is just as sacred as in this famed glass building somewhere. My name is Christine Marquette, and I'm a registered and licensed dietitian with Marquette Nutrition and Fitness, and I'm going to talk to you about the medical benefits of hibiscus tea. Hibiscus tea has actually been shown to lower blood pressure. For many years, a lot of people who practice traditional medicine or herbal medicine have purported hibiscus tea to lower blood pressure. Um, some of the thought was that it acts as a diuretic, and often diuretics are used to help lower blood pressure. Recently, there was actually a study published in early 2008 that showed that it does actually reduce blood pressure almost as much as some prescription strength medications. Exactly how it works is not known. It may be the diuretic effect. It may be something else. Hibiscus flowers actually have a lot of different phytochemicals in them that give them that dark red color. They have a lot of antioxidants as well. So in addition to lowering blood pressure, there is the potential that hibiscus tea may have some other health benefits as well. We already know that antioxidants in other fruits and vegetables may help prevent certain forms of cancer. They also help with your overall health as far as actually improving your cardiac function, how, how your blood flows, how resilient your vessels are, their flexibility, all of those sorts of things. So hibiscus tea has that potential as well. We will know when there are more studies done. But at this point, we definitely know that it can actually help with lowering blood pressure. Some of the other benefits um, as far as your cardiac health it may actually have the potential to lower cholesterol, to lower your bad cholesterol, and to help increase your healthy cholesterol. But those are things that are still being researched right now. Nothing has actually been uh, published that says definitively it does. Uh, but as far as the blood pressure, that's the primary medicinal benefit that we see from hibiscus tea. How you doing, Miss Rainey? I see you took the, the raspberry and ginger. Can you tell me the benefits that it did for you? It helped my hand. Okay. Made me to move my help me able to I can move my legs and my feet. Amen. And you do you have um you have M yeah. MS. MS. Okay, but it did help you out when you were using it. It really helped yeah, you out. Yeah, it really did. Amen. Thank you so much, Miss Irene. You're more than welcome. <laughs> Fanny here and she has been taking some of the drinks. What drink are you taking? The raspberry mm -hmm. for the stomach and the coconut for my hair for my nails. Okay. And how do you work? The raspberry is absolutely wonderful, as you can see. I'm starting to get a little smaller. Okay, okay. <laughs> and the coconut, I just started that, okay. but I noticed my nails have started, started to grow, and they are a little harder than what they used to be. Don't split as easily. Okay. So I'm going to keep using it and see how that works. Okay. okay. And you, what? So tell me about your feet it, problem. And my feet don't hurt no more. And it's so, and it's so good. Good for your skin? You got skin for skin, or it's really good for your skin? Yeah. Okay. I love it. So how much weight have you lost? Not sure about that, but I know I ain't 180 pounds where I used to be. Amen. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah. Hey. Shemaine, uh, who you have there with you? Right now we have Miss Garrett here, and she's in the process of taking some of the drinks with her. What, what drinks are you taking? Oh my God, I love my juice. I like the pineapple, raspberry. And since I've been taking all this juice, I've been feeling great. Amen. And I'm looking to feel better and better every day. 
you are missing something. So if you don't know about this juice, please get in contact with the owner. My name is Sister Betty Garrett, and I'm in title, Loving That Juice. Did, you cut a little step for minutes ago now. I saw her cut a yeah. step now. Yeah. <laughs> But she's feeling good. May um she Matt may you get into more details about um how you feeling? You was in the yard, so can you you just you doing so much now. Your pastor's enjoying it. My pastor, my friends, and I love the soap. Yeah. I feel good with the soap. Mm -hmm. It's too good with my skin. And right now I sleep good. And mm -hmm. also I don't get tired anymore. Amen. Amen. So I tell you what, you are missing something. Please try that juice. <laughs> Give myself away I give myself away So you can use me I give myself away I give myself away So you can Come on, let him know I give myself away I give myself away So you can use me I give myself away What would happen if a generation embraced this? Come on, tell me. Here I am. Here I am. 